We convinced Representative Charlie Meyer to take a few minutes out from the harvest for his take five. Representative, ready for questions? Yes. Tell us about Margaret. Well, Margaret's a chicken that's running around in their yard. I always had a chicken and a rooster to help make the place look like an old farm. The rooster started attacking people, so he's back in the chicken house. And since then, Margaret's got this wonderful personality she's developed. She thinks she's a dog. She follows us around the yard like a dog does. She'll run up and eat out of your hand sometimes. And if you're working outside and, and have a table saw running close to the house, she'll just maybe lay her egg on the table saw while you're carrying a board in or else in the carpenter's trailer. How long has your farm been in the family? The, this farm was bought in 1905, and this house was built in 1907. My grandmother pulled all the logs home with a team of mules for the house to be built for her parents. And how long have you been in the General Assembly? I've been in the legislature for five years now. Last book you read? I'm currently reading about All My Dreams Came True. It's a book about a, a young farm kid growing up in the 30s and 40s and how he went off into service for the Vietnam and, and Korean Wars and became a machinist and came back and worked the farm, worked as a machinist. And later on in his life, he started going around the world and helping develop other countries, teaching them agriculture, taking Soviet tanks and cutting them up and making thrashing machines out of them. So it's a very interesting book and how he wanted to travel the world and how he has traveled the world now. He even worked on the Jupiter um, rocket to launch our first satellite into space. Play any sports? I play a little bit of volleyball yet. Who's your role model? My role model would be my grandpa's and they always taught me to treat everybody with respect and always take time to listen to them and talk to them. Favorite cupcake? Any cupcake made by Chloe. She's a young girl from my district who the health department had stopped her from selling her cupcakes and so we went and we, we drafted legislation and we had 95 health departments slip in against it but we were able to move the legislation forward and so now Chloe can make cupcakes and she's been on the Junior Cupcakes TV show even. Prize memento in your office. I have a picture from my uh, residence at Murray Center and it has all their fingerprints on it because many of them can't, can't speak or even see but we have their fingerprints on them showing their appreciation for all we've done for them. And how do you start your day? I uh, start my day with usually a very untypical breakfast of what's ever in the refrigerator get myself going and uh, get to work. I, I've always worked hard my entire life and still believe in working. We work seven days a week. What album would people be surprised to learn you own? Pink Floyd, The Wall. I, I just one of my favorite ones of all. Name of your first pet? A dog named Shaggy, and we also had one named Sputnik at the same time. What do you like to do in your spare time? Um, in my spare time, there, there's really not much spare time, but... I, I love to garden and, and can, and, and I just really like to work. I don't travel much either. What's your hidden talent? It is probably my cooking. I, I am a very good cook. Many people will tell you that, and I cook many different benefits in the area for 4-H, FFA, or other benefits. Favorite part of your job? Favorite part of my job is going and, and helping people and trying to make a difference I really enjoy when I'm talking with the 4-H kids or FFA kids or school kids, telling them about the future and, and how trying to help them have a bright future. What advice would you give your 20-year-old self? When I look back to thinking about myself at 20, every morning I got up and milked cows. Every night I, I milked cows before I could go out. And um, maybe it would be sell the cows. Favorite food? Favorite food is, uh, once again, either either cupcakes or stuffed peppers. The one thing you can't leave home without? My cell phone. I'm just about like every other American anymore. Favorite TV show? I love Lucy. Rolling Stones or Pink Floyd? Pink Floyd. What is a Centennial Farm? Centennial Farm is a farm that has been owned by a family for more than 100 years. And so we classify as a Centennial Farm and I have very distant cousins who own a farm since the 1780s. And how long does it take you to Springfield? It takes me about two hours to get to Springfield. What is your favorite constituent moment? My favorite constituent moment is uh, 
the moment when we had a lawsuit against the state of Illinois representing the most severely and profoundly handicapped residents and we were able to stop the state from taking away their home. How would you describe your district? My district is mainly a, a rural district up against the St. Louis metropolitan area. Representative Charlie Meyer, thanks for your time. Thank you.